In part 3 of our Getting Started series with Measure Square 8, we will cover Product and Services Database Setup. Database Folder Structure In this part of the series, we'll cover the database folder structure layout within Measure Square 8. Measure Square 8 supports a multi-layer folder structure as seen here on the left-hand side of our Takeoff tab. We can see we have a carpet folder, and if we expand this folder, we have subcategories such as broad loom, carpet tile, pattern match, and so on. We can expand these second level folders to reveal products. To add a new folder or to rearrange the order of the folders, let's right click on the product and services and click View Modify Details. We can go over here to our product database section and if we'd simply like to move a folder around, we can left click to highlight the folder here, like so and click on the up or down arrows to reposition its place in the database. If we would like to move a product from one folder to another, we can, for example, open up our broad loom and pattern match folder, and we can take carpet 7, left click to highlight it blue, and drag and drop it in to the pattern match folder, like so. We can even drag and drop a folder from a current position inside another folder. For example, we can take our Northeast Labor Install Charges, left click to highlight that folder, and drag it in to the Labor Services folder where it's now nested beneath, like so. If we need to make a new folder, we can left click where it says Products and Services, and then click on the New Folder button to make a new folder in our database. We can name the new folder and click OK. In part two of our product and services database setup series, we will cover the product list in Measure Square 8. 